Join me as I dive into the world of home organization gadgets and see if I can find the most satisfying ones out there. We've all been there. Cluttered cupboards, messy drawers, and a general feeling of chaos when it comes to our living spaces. It can be overwhelming, especially when you're trying to relax and unwind. But I think one of the biggest challenges we face with home organization is knowing where to start. You might have the best of intentions, but without the right tools and strategies, it can be hard to make progress. Moving on, today I'm excited to test out some home organization gadgets that promise to make our lives easier. Each of these gadgets has caught my attention for different reasons, and I'm curious to see how they'll perform in real-life scenarios. First up, for your drawers, we have drawer dividers and drawer organizers. These are perfect for keeping everything in its place from utensils in the kitchen to socks and accessories in your bedroom. If you want to take drawer organization to the next level, clear plastic drawers are a great solution. These are perfect for organizing smaller items while still being able to see everything at a glance. They work wonders in your office, bathroom, or even your kitchen. Speaking of kitchen organization, the 60-piece food storage container set will be your new best friend. This set will keep your kitchen looking tidy while keeping your food fresh. Pair it with a rotating spice rack to keep all your favorite spices neatly displayed and easy to grab when cooking. The pot and pan organizer is a game changer for those pots and pans cluttering up your cabinets. This organizer keeps your cookware stacked and easily accessible. Plus, clear storage bins are ideal for organizing your pantry or fridge, making it easy to store and see your ingredients. And for maximizing space, the Lazy Susan allows you to access everything without knocking over other items. Also, the over-the-door pantry organizer is perfect for adding extra storage for snacks, canned goods, or spices. For additional storage in bathrooms, the three-tier rolling cart is the perfect choice. It's mobile, compact, and gives you extra storage where you need it most. If you're looking to save space in the bathroom, the over-the-door towel rack and suction cup hooks are perfect for hanging towels and other essentials. Keep your shower essentials organized with a shower caddy. This sleek caddy holds everything from shampoo bottles to soap and loofahs, keeping your shower space clutter-free. Pair it with clear acrylic organizers for your vanity, perfect for storing makeup, skin care, and other toiletries. If you're ready to transform your home, stick until the end and watch our product review now to discover why it's getting so many sales. So I don't know if you have a drawer like this, like I do in my kitchen, but I hope not. But I plan on getting this kind of all arranged and really nice and organized. It's, it's really just a complete mess. So what I did is I bought a four pack of these dividers. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and try to change it up and make it look great. So let's go ahead and get started. So I've got it all complete as you can see, and it looks wonderful. It's, it was just such a big mess and, a, and it was a, really just an eyesore for me. So I'm really glad I got these dividers. What I really like about these is that you can, you can situate these any way you want, so you can subdivide this up. So I've got it up into three different sections. When uh, the section, when it's, when it's not extended out, it's 11 inches deep. But if you want to extend it all the way out, we got up to around 17 inches. And I didn't want to use the whole depth of the drawer because these are only four inches deep, but the drawer is actually less than that. If you're looking for a really good utensil organizer, I definitely would check this out. We had recently moved and we have really, really wide cabinets. And so I wanted a utensil holder that will fit the width of our cabinet. And I found this one and I absolutely love it. It's in the color matte black and it's made of this like really thick um, plastic material, which is really good because I can clean it very, very easily. Both of the sides expand and contract, so you can adjust the width of this depending on the width of your cabinet. And there are stoppers right here, so it doesn't slide all the way off and you'd have to try and put it back on. Once it slides all the way to the max, there's a little stopper right here, which keeps everything nice and secure. There are five slots here for your main eating utensils, and then you have wider ones on the side. I like to use for the larger cooking utensils that I use, and there's also a slot up top here for extra utensils um, that we like to use on a regular basis. But these I bins are perfect to organize any drawer. They come in four different sizes, extra small, small, medium, and large. They can hold quite a few items within them. 
They come in the 25 pack. I didn't even use all 25 of them. I still have some extras, so I could use them in a makeup drawer or an office drawer. But if you would like an organized drawer, no matter what the drawer is, you should get these bins. I've had them now for seven months, and here's my drawer today. Hey, help me unbox this Rubbermaid BPA-free 50-piece Tupperware set. First, let's take a look at the box to see what they say about what's inside. I love their easy lid find system you can see on the bottom left corner. The lids and bases of the Tupperware snap together, which makes for a tidy storage. The package includes six half cup Tupperwares with lids, five one and a quarter cup Tupperwares, four two cup Tupperwares, four three cup Tupperwares, three five cup Tupperwares, two seven cup Tupperwares, and one nine cup Tupperware. Let's take a quick look at the rest of the box before we open it. Upon opening, my first impression is everything is really clean and neat and tidy. I cannot believe this is a 50 piece set. It all fits together very compact. Let's look at it all on the counter to get a better idea of what it looks like and take a closer peek. I really love how all the different sizes stack into each other to make for clean organization. After our close-up look at all these, I'll give you a look at how they fit into my pantry. I love that nine of the Tupperware lids are ventilated. Here's an up-close look at that ventilation. Okay, let's see how the lids snap on to the Tupperware. They all have a slight silicone type lining in the lid for an airtight seal, and they snap on super tight. I'm really happy with these. The plastic you can tell is thick and high quality, and I cannot wait to use these. 10 out of 10, I highly recommend this Tupperware set. Guys, right, so let me show you this 20 jar spice rack that I got. Um, it uh, comes in a box just like this. Um, they're all individual and they sit on. So let me show you what this looks like. Um, I really like it because it spins um, really easy. And then if you need one, you can always just, you know, pull it out um, and then put it back in. Um, it puts, puts, uh, pushes in really nicely. Um, you can just pull that one out right and then it pushes in really nicely. So it comes with uh, 20... 20, I believe. Um, it's really nice. Sea salt, bay leaves, they're all there. Um, the reason why I like it so much is because it's silver. It sits right in my pantry and it's perfect and then spins nice and easy as so. Um, this thing is sturdy. It's not going to fall. Um, these, um, when you get them, they come sealed, which is really nice so that you know stuff doesn't fall right out. But then you just put the cap back on, tighten it up, and then put it back. So really great for my cupboard um, and my spice rack. If you are searching for the perfect way to organize your pots and pans, look no further than this organizer right here. So my name's Carissa. This is a totally honest and unbiased product review video. And I'm just going to share some features with you about this to hopefully help you make a more informed buying decision. So as a busy mom, keeping my kitchen organized is definitely a top priority. And that's why this thing has been a game changer. So the eight tiers of this organizer offer plenty of space to store pots, pans, lids, all of those things. And I love that the dividers are adjustable so you can cut customize um, to the size of each tier to fit, you know, your different pots and pans um, and make it best for your space. Also love the versatility of the um, organizer. It can be mounted on the wall, hung over a door or placed on a countertop. So we obviously have ours just placed on a shelf in one of our cupboards. Um, it comes with three DIY methods. So you can truly choose what is best for your kitchen. Um, it is so sturdy. Our pots are pretty heavy and you can see me sliding it out and sliding it back on here as well. The best part of this organizer is truly that it's helped save so much space in our kitchen. Like there'd be no way that we'd be able to stack our pots and pans like you see them um, here. And before we got this, it was just taking up so much space and making it difficult for what we really needed. But now they are organized nice and neat. These clear stackable storage bins are so versatile and can be used for many different storage needs. We use ours for our medicine, snacks, toiletries, and art supplies. We also use these in our pantry. Really versatile and we love that they're clear so you can see what's inside them. Love that they have the handles. It makes it easier to pull things out when you need them. We also use them without the lid for easy to grab snacks. And especially for the smaller size snacks, this is a really great option. This size here is the seven and a half by 11 by six inches tall size. And we really love this size for the pantry and the fridge and especially those more 
narrow upper cabinets that we have in our kitchen work really well for that. These are this is the herb or kitchen organizer. I absolutely love mine. As you can see, it's absolutely ram packed full of herbs. You can fit so much on here. Like, look how much on the top and then on the bottom as well. And it's got like a very smooth turn to it. Um, and it's see through, it's really like quite sturdy considering I've got all this weight on there. Um, I think this is a must have in everyone's kitchen, to be quite honest. I actually want to buy a few more and put them in cupboards that are high up um, so that you don't have to get a stool and you could just turn them in the cupboard and get whatever you need down. So yeah, that's how it looks. If you need extra storage in your pantry, I definitely would check this out. I found this pantry organizer and it works really, really well. Very easy to put together. It has two hooks on the top. What's really nice about it, it has these slits so you can move the basket higher or lower depending on where you need the baskets to sit, how tall your items are in the basket. It comes with nine different baskets so it goes down the length of the door. Um, it also comes with these uh, sticky attachments here so you can mount it on your door. I absolutely love this. This works really, really well. It adds so much storage to my pantry. So if you're looking for an amazing pantry organizer, I definitely recommend this one. Hey there, I just want to give you a quick um, rundown of this three-tiered shelf. I just got this on Amazon. Um, it came in a very small package, so I was wondering, oh, is this actually going to be big enough? But it definitely is. They just had it um, very efficiently packed. This took me less than three minutes to put together. Um, each of these literally just snap into each other. Comes with the nice handles here at the top. Of course, the bottom has wheels, so you can easily move it. Of course, I don't have anything in here right now yet, so um, I don't, you know, it, it wiggles a little bit when you move it. Um, but even so, it's very light, and um, this is a nice white color. I like that. It's got a little bit of texture here. I'll be using this for baby items for postpartum and for, like, diapers and things like that. But, um, yeah, really happy with this. I like that. It was at a good price and something that I'll use. It's very practical. All right, so today I'm going to review this over-the-door towel hanger. So because... We, we don't have a small bathroom, but the wall space is not so much. So we don't have any hangers or anywhere to hang our towels or our big towels. So we got this over the door hanger and basically it's this, this is the size. And it literally goes over the door and you can hang one, two, three towels. And I like how it tears out like that. So that way the towels don't really touch each other when they're hanging so they can fully dry. It has two hooks, one here, one on this side and like literally you could just this comes right off but you can close the door completely and it won't affect the door the door jam or anything like that it literally perfectly goes right underneath the door jam so i highly recommend this if you do not have space to hang your towels this shower hook does exactly what you need it to do it's not only great for your house or your apartment, it's great if you have a kid going off to college and say in like a dorm and whatever and they need a towel hook hanger or this hanger can also hang up like your soap accessories rack if you get one of those. But yeah, this is awesome if you have a kid going off to college or someone living in a dorm. This is a huge hook that can help them out. But yeah, I would definitely recommend for anyone having a kid or a friend going off to college, this is a great gift for them. So today we are looking at this shower caddy. I do have these little built-in shelves into my shower, but even these aren't enough. And so this is a great alternative if you are looking for more shelves inside of your shower or you don't have any and you need uh, some, some, some shelves to put things on. Um, the company did send this to me, but I'm gonna be giving it a full and honest review. And we're gonna go through it in the installation process and actually testing these things out. So let's jump right in. So in this box itself, it comes with two of these longer kind of shelves. You can see uh, they have just a little hook here. These are really easy to install. All we use is an adhesive. There's no drilling or anything like that. So you have the two smaller shelves like this, kind of just uh, for, you know, you could use this for a bar of soap or for razors, different things like that. You have two of those. A small, tall one here that we're gonna go through and install as well. So that's what's come inside the box. You do have the adhesives themselves. And I'm gonna show you how to use these right now. So the first step to install these is make sure you go through and wipe off the surface where you're wanting to install them. I've already gone through and done that. What you're going to do next is grab one of these adhesives and what you can see, you can see what these, how these work basically is 
there's a little hook right here that these will clamp onto after we stick this part to the wall. So basically go through and identify where you want your, your basket, your shelf to hang. Kind of, you may want to kind of hold the basket up to get an idea of the height of it. You can see these are clear, so you can't really see the adhesive in the back, which is awesome. What I want to do is I'm going to use a level just to make sure that this is leveled out. What you're going to do now is just peel this back just like this, tear off this little part. We're going to go. So we now have the big one right here, the small shallow one, and then the deep small one right here. We're gonna wait 24 hours for these to go through and settle and then put them to the weight test. I of course do have an extra one of these ones and these ones that I'm not gonna be using for the shower because I think this will give me enough room and space uh, for my shelves, but let's come back in 24 hours and put these things to the test. Okay, it's now been 24 hours and these claim to be able to hold 40 pounds of weight basically. I My 25 pound weights won't fit inside of here they're a little bit too big but i do have these 10 pound weights so let's go through and see what this does when we put these weights inside of here you can see it has no problem holding that in there we can try to fit these kind of i don't know if they're gonna um you can see wow that's impressive so there's 20 pounds right there it's not even really budging or anything like that um, and these are kind of leaning towards the front so definitely holding up to the weight test can definitely hold all of your heavy shampoos and things like that so I'm actually gonna go through and load this thing up and we can see what it all looks like when all my uh, shampoo and crap is inside. Okay, so this is perfect. You can see we got three heavy body wash slash shampoos for me and my wife inside of here. I have the this one that's holding these. These have these little hooks so you can put razors on them just like that on both sides. And then I just put a bar of my wife's soap that she likes to use to remove her makeup on there. And then I have uh, my shaving gel right here for when I go through and shave. So um, this is exactly what I needed. Like I said, I even have an extra one of these that I could maybe hang up right here if I needed more space or even above, above here. And then I have another one of these that could go down below as well. But uh, great value and certainly something that I recommend. They hold up the weight test and they look great. So this is a 10 piece drawer organizer set that I just bought off of Amazon and I'm excited to get it opened up and get some of my drawers organized. And so this is what the set looks like. So you have one big piece, you have three long pieces, three medium and three small. And I plan on using them for organizing things. This is in my in-home hair salon. So I'm gonna put my, my clipper guards in some and um, some combs and things like that in them. I will say overall, I do like that they have these like little bumps in there. So it's kind of like to give it some traction, I'm assuming so things don't slide around as much. That's kind of cool. And then the bottom, it has little feet as well. So here's an example of what it looks like now that I've used it. I got my guards in here. Then we got our trimmer guards in the back. And here I just kind of have like miscellaneous combs and clips. I'm content with my purchase. Be sure to check out the products I featured using the affiliate link in the description below. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and tap the bell icon so you never miss an update. Thanks again, and I'll see you in the next video.